Researchers studying the evolutionary patterns in Neanderthals say they have discovered new insights into the ancient humans. They analyzed 17 skulls from the Middle Pleistocene time period, all of which were found in a Spanish cave known as Cima de los Huesos. The report published in the journal Science explains how the evolution of Neanderthals, also known as Neanderthals, is a bit more complicated than we previously thought. Facial modification was the first step in the evolution of the Neanderthal lineage, pointing to a mosaic pattern of evolution with different anatomical and functional modules evolving at different rates. The study leads researchers to believe these primitive humans developed their facial features before developing large brains, not all at once. Which helps explain away controversy previously surrounding the Cima de los Huesos fossils. International Business Times says researchers used to believe the Cima fossils were around 530,000 years old, but were unsure because scientific evidence, such as carbon dating, didn't match up with the shape and development of the skulls. Using six different techniques to date the fossils, fossils, the team discovered they all converged on 430,000 years ago. The researchers say this discovery helps to confirm something called the accretion model. According to the National Center for Biotechnology Information, the model holds that late Pleistocene hominids evolved in partial or complete genetic isolation from the rest of humanity. In simpler terms, the researchers have compared the model to HBO's Game of Thrones. While large tribes competed with each other for survival, each tribe's gene pool was still largely isolated and evolved to survive based on their environment. And one more comparison to the popular series, the scientists noted environmental changes like thick patches of ice and glaciers may have led to the different periods of diversification. In other words, winter was coming, and it came many times. For Newsy, I'm Micah Sargent.